Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'm talking about Majeev Singh Hunan. Today, the search engine Google Doodle is celebrating 92nd birthday of Majeev Singh Hunan. Who was Majeev Singh Hunan? Let's talk about Majeev Singh Hunan short biography. If you like this video, then like, comment, share, and subscribe. Majeev Singh Hunan was a South African poet best known for his translation of the epic zoo poem while in exile from South Africa's apartheid. Khunen was an active supporter and organizer of an anti-apartheid movement in Europe and Africa. He would later teach at University of California, Los Angeles and become Africa's and South Africa's first poet laureate. Neen was born in Durban on 12th of May 1930 in the modern province of Paul Zohu, South Africa. He was born in Durban to Eva Kunin, a teacher, and Madhavuli Albert Kunin, a laborer. From very early in his childhood, he began writing poetry and short stories in Zulu. And by the age of 11, he was being published in local papers. He went on a, to earn a Bachelor's of Arts degree from the University of Natal in Zulu and History and later a Master of Arts in Zulu Poetry. His master's thesis was titled An Analytic Survey of Zulu poetry, both traditional and modern. In it, Kunin criticized the changing nature of Zulu literature and its emulation of the Western tradition. He won a Bantu literary competition in 1956 and left for London, England to study at the School of Oriental and African Studies, University of London in 1959. He opposed the Apartheid government as the head of African United Front. Fleeing into exile from the country in 1959, he helped push for the anti-apartheid movement in Britain between 1959 and 1968. Kunin was closely affiliated with the African National Congress, quickly becoming their main representative in Europe and the United States in 1962. He would later become the director of finance for an ANC in 1972. He became a professor of African literature at the University of California, Los Angeles, in 1975 after lecturing in a number of universities as a cultural advisor of UNESCO. He remained at UCLA for nearly two decades, retiring in 1992. Queen wrote and published poetry from very early in his life. His works were written originally in Zulu and then translated into English. In 1966, his works were banned by the apartheid government of South Africa in 1969. He wrote an introduction to the translation by John Berger and Anna Bostock of Amy Chassis returned to my native land. Kunin returned to South Africa in 1992 where he taught at the University of Natal until his retirement. UNESCO made him Africa's poet laureate in 1993 and in 2005 he became South Africa's first poet laureate. Kunin died on 11th of August 2006 in Durban after a lengthy pot of cancer. So today Doodle is celebrating the 92nd birthday of Mazisi Kunen, an anti-apartheid acti activist and South African poet whose work recorded the history of the Zulu people. Post-apartheid, uh, Kunin returned to South Africa to continue writing in the Zulu in 1993. UNESCO honored him as uh, Africa's poet Lirid. 
He later also became the first poet laureate of Democratic South Africa. His legacy lies on not only in his poetry but also the Majisi Kunin Foundation Trust, which is dedicated to nurturing Africa's next generation of literary talent. Happy birthday, Majisi Kunin! Hope you like this video. Then do like, comment, share, and subscribe. Press the bell icon for more latest videos. Thanks for watching.